What's up, guys? It's Raw here, bringing you guys another NHL 19 Be a Pro with our center number 11, Rahul. Um, today we are going up against my former team, the Boston Bruins. Now, this episode is going to be a little bit shorter than others. You may be thinking, why? Well, Again, I edited the video. Good job on me. However, there's going to be a little bit of an issue. You may be thinking, why? Well, as you're going to be in a see in a little bit, as you see, we are currently leading the division, and I am on the second line currently because I'm not doing the um. First base off. Um, I'm going up against um certain players like Patrice Bergeron. Those guys, I think, are amazing. Yeah, I say that because I'm on a team that the Boston Bruins hate. And now, if I were traded to the Montreal Canadiens. That's going to be a different story. I mean, maybe for like, oh no, I have to get out. No. Oh. There's something bad there, as you can see. I don't know why I did that, so I won't do it again. That's all I like to say, because I do weird stuff. Not like that, though. See, I get a good, uh, I get a good shot. I get, I do mostly everything good. Sees all across the board. Um, that's what I'm not currently worried. Um, you're good. Uh, currently we have a power play on our fingertips, and we get a power play goal. Yes, that's. How we do things. Power play goals. That's what I like. I like power play goals. Um, currently serving a face-off. It did not go well. Um, trying to work on my face-offs. That's my main priority at this current point. I either do tie-ups or... Like, press A with the right stick down, and that's how I do a face-off, normally. Oh no, not icing. I got called of icing. Now, offside and icing don't remove your XP problems. So, I'm a little bit happy about that-ish. So, me as a NHL guy... And eventually a Madden guy. Um, it, it really means a lot to me that that sort of features need to be, like, implemented. For example, like, I wish, like, in NHL 19, 20, they had, like, college. Like, imagine that for a moment. You are playing in high school. Like, they had, like, imagine, like, they had, like, a high school feature. Like, like in NCAA, like a NCAA version of hockey. Like, imagine that for a moment. I, now, I know there probably is. However, if they, if any, if, um, what should I call it? If NHL did something like that, had like some kind of feature of be a pro where you could potentially do that, then that would be amazing. Like, you start as a senior in high school, you are playing, you you with the state championship, all of that. And I think that would add some element to the game. Then you choose your college. And then if you do well at college, you get to play. Don't. Well, then you go to uh, the AHL or the ECA, is ECHL. Yes. Or you immediately play in an NHL if you do well. 
and you get dropped and everything, and everything is sorted out. And that's where the actual B Pearl starts, where you start your legacy. I think that's going to be good. Also, what might be also good is that if they implemented a rule, like in hockey, where you can at least play for one year at college. As you can see, I got myself an assist. So, these things that I'm talking about for NHL 20 might not be implemented, considering that that would take a long time to do, especially for the fact that they would have to see, um, hot at EA. Like, the reason why I think that EA stopped making hockey, like, I mean, foot NCAA of football uh, video games is because the last time they tried, that ended up not working. And I think this time, it could work. So, I mean, like, what or whatever you gotta do it is whatever you have to do to make a good hockey video game. That's all I gotta say. So, my you, I really want a hockey video game at some point. Uh, like a NCAA, NCAA version. As you can see, the first period ends. Two to uh, we're leading to zero. I really like the fact that um, so onwards with the NCAA stuff. If they implemented that, that would be amazing. For franchise mode, um, I don't know. Oh, on to the point of my um, if high school players can go into call uh. NHL. Now, you may know in the NBA that happens in the NFL. Um, in the NBA, first year, second year, third year, or even first, second, third year players of college basketball players can go into the NBA. High school players could do that. However, that is a risk. Now, imagine if that happened in, and in the NHL. Like, you can see, like, the NHL, like, <sighs> sorry. You can see, like, the NHL, like, franchise, like, as, like, the league changing. Because if you remember Wayne Gretzky, he played hockey at the, I think, the WHA at the age of 16. 16. That is a very young age for a guy for uh, like Wayne Gretzky, and he had the ge like he was a god at hockey, like you couldn't deny it. So, if they implemented it in NHL, where high school, high school player, high school hockey players, from high school to like third year, as you can see, I scored myself a goal. Um. That would change a lot of things, especially for like European play. Uh, for now, oh, I have to get into this. Now watch, I get a fight into number seventy three. I immediately get knocked out out of that fight. Now, you may be thinking, why? I got myself an injury. That guy broke my nose, and I'm sorry for this, but my controller. <laughs> so, I'm a little sad that I cannot play for the rest of the game. So, the score ended up being 3-1. to one. Which, uh, wait. That is only, uh, sorry, <laughs> replay mode, but that is only for that point, for a period two. Now, for period three, um, this, this keeps going, <sighs> sorry, it is, uh, we add another goal into the box, and it takes a while for me to get recover, um, because... As for the next game, I cannot play it against the New York Rangers. It takes, like, about a certain amount of days. And, yeah. 
I feel a little bit bad, but in the end, I feel happy. Happy. I feel happy about that. So, we skip to the Pittsburgh Penguins game. Yes, the Pittsburgh Penguins, who I absolutely hate as as you can see, we are like the like uh we're gonna play the Pittsburgh pa -pa -pa Penguins. The Pittsburgh pa -pa -pa Penguins are really dumb. And as you can see, I am gonna play against the Pittsburgh Penguins. Yes, I said that right. So the Pittsburgh Penguins are, uh, how can I say it, are one of those awkward, t uh, those hateful teams that I absolutely hate. So, going back to what I said about that part, the NHL stuff, for NHL 20, yeah, I think that they should add that, really should add that, about, like, college stuff, high school stuff, um, if NHL were to have, like, some kind of, like, other video game, like, other than, like, NHL 19, NHL 20, they had NCAA uh, hockey, like, NCAA uh, hockey, like, uh, something, I think that would be nice, and if they actually had the, the license to, like, take players' names, that would actually be nice. So, I mean, you already had the NHLPA do that with NHL of the video game series. If they did that with a new video game, oh, sorry, sorry, then that would be nice because I think that that, that could like implement a new system and bring something to the game of the NHL realm. I said it like that. Yes. I said it like that. So, it's going to be interesting because in like a couple of years, I think, I suppose, if we could get like as um, like if we get Oh my gosh. Oh, sorry, I'm tired. Like, if we could get, like, uh, something abroad, as you see, I get myself an assist. Did I get myself an assist? Yes, I did get myself an assist. So, it's going to be interesting upon us because it will be interesting. Oh my gosh, I get myself into another fight. This time against, I do not know who this guy is. It's number 58. And I really don't want to fight this guy. You may be thinking why. I do not want to get hurt so bad. And I lost. Get knocked to the ground. I hate getting into fights so much to the point where I just don't want to get hit. Like, that's how I would say it. I don't want to get hurt. I do not want to get into a fight. So, that's just, like, how I am. Like, I don't, like, in real life for me, I never want to get into a fight. I just get into an argument, that's it. I'm not going to get into a physical fight. Now, if I have to... Actually, you know what? No, I'm not going to do that because... A, that's gonna be stupid. As you can see, I get myself a goal for the awkward fact that two guys, two guys did not defend me. <laughs> uh, that is stupid. Do not carry your team off sides. <laughs> that affects team play. Uh, yeah. I'm also trying to learn how not how to do don't do poke checks. 
that kind of stuff because I'm learning a lot. So, trying to figure out what I want to do. Let's refer to Quebec Nordiques. I'm thinking I might finish out season two and then um do something else like maybe a Tampa Bay uh, franchise or until like this is uh this has to work like if I could get myself a franchise player like I get myself Connor McDavid or any of those guys or at least Patrice Bergeron then I could be nice like it has to work because it, 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 like, it must really drastically change the game. And I think that, um, we could do this. Like, if we could do this, then we have to do this. Like, for the Quebec Nordiques, it is the lifeblood of this channel, to me. Like, every single year, I will do this, and then, like, for another season, I could do it. And then, I could do this for, like, the rest of my life. Because I think that it's going to be amazing. It's going to work. Then I can have a good time. Then I can have a good time for anyone that is uh, working. If you guys want it, then I can bring it to you. If you guys don't want it, well, then I will just stop breaking. And I will leave it dormant. I will not do anything with this franchise. And I will just say this. Y'all don't understand how much I love the Quebec Nordiques. That's all I can say. I love the Quebec Nordiques so much. Passion in my heart. I just don't understand why y'all think that the Quebec Nordiques are very, very impromptu to this channel. Is it because you don't like it? Well, if you say that, well, that that's just pretty much stupid. That's honestly stupid enough to say. Why the heck are you doing this? Why, like, why? Why would you say that? Huh. I don't like that sometimes, so. Huh. So, we're finishing up this, um, series, and we would, like that, we would 3 and 0. That's kind of nice, because I think that it's gonna be something. Also, sorry for any noises in the background earlier. We jump in into the Washington Capitals game. We are currently winning, uh, three, uh, two, one. We're leading with that much. I'm trying to score goals as usual. Try to get myself a good trophy, which is called the Barish Richard Award. You may be thinking, what is the Maurice Richard Award? Well, it was a guy named Maurice Richard. He scored back with the Montreal Canadiens in the original six era. He scored 50 goals in a 50 game season. You heard that right. 50 goals in a 50 game season. I know that's ridiculous, but it is possible in any way, shape, or form. Because it is possible in any realm. Any realm. Oh, that's awkward because any realm. Yeah, I know that. Sometimes I don't know what I say. Let's just put it that way. I don't know what I say sometimes. So, onward, my good friends. We are here with a quest. That quest is this. We shall do whatever it takes to become a great YouTube channel and make good content. That's my number one priority. Make good content and then uh, you can practically do whatever you want. That does, oh gosh, that doesn't make sense. That does not make sense. How, how, why would you say that? Come on. Why would you say that? I mean, like, yeah. Why would you say that? Meh. I don't know why I say sometimes, but hey. If it works out for me, did it work out for me? 
I also do pre-recorded stuff every single day. Um, uh, I think that's nice because I get to do what I want on this channel. <sighs> it's just the fact that I am doing so, so much stuff. Um, like, every day I'm grinding out this series. And I think that's a good thing in some aspects, some bad things in some aspects. As you can see, I get myself an assist, boys! Oh gosh, I am so down for this! Yes, 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 yes. Also, I don't know if I'm going to Twitch stream or not. Because, um, I don't know what to do. Because I'm not gonna Twitch stream that much. Uh, I, I don't know what to do, and, like, I'm not really familiar with, um, Twitch, Twitch streaming, that stuff, I'm gonna, let's put it this way, I will do whatever it takes to play a certain game at your level best. That is all I am gonna say. If that's bothering you, I don't know what is. So, I'm just going to say that, uh, that I'm going to start playing the Quebec Origins. As you can see, I get leveled by Alexander Ovechkin. <sighs> I hate that guy very much, uh, to the point where I hate him. I literally hate him. Oh, gosh. There I go. Put the corner back. More dicks. Huh. So, season two with the Quebec Dicks. I'm gonna be playing, um, it's been a good while since I played with the Quebec Dicks. It's going to be interesting, it's going to be lighthearted, it's going to be loving. So, I hope you guys are ready for that. Are you, I hope you guys I hope you guys are ready for the comeback. Especially for Madden. I, I'm going to bring Madden in some way, shape, or form. Because, man, the Quebec Nordiques are going to be riding with the series. Uh, I think that... I think that since the Quebec Nordiques are the lifeblood, I think that this series is going to be about the Quebec Nordiques. Uh, that's all I, I, I that's all I can say because, to me, the Quebec Nordiques have to do something with the series. That's all I, I, I don't know what to say about uh, more about it because, it's just something. It's just like lifeblood, lifeblood, more lifeblood. So, like, so yeah, as you see, we won the game, and now we're going up again against Anaheim. Now, for an Anaheim game, I, I kind of did something, and oh gosh, it's not good. So, this episode is going to finish out in a game. <laughs> I am not happy about that, but hey. Uh, I don't know what else to say because that is not simply good at all. So, uh, anyways, guys, thank y'all so much for watching. Y'all are legends of my book, and as for me, I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace. Let's get this bread, boys.